I also wanted to show you this other piece of video, and it's um, because I just can't wait to get your take on her body language when she is served okay. uh, poolside in her skimpy bikini with her new husband beside her, and then his body language too when the police sort of throw down and say, "You've been served with a warrant." Produce the kids. Here's the moment. Take a look. Hi. How's it going? Hi. Are you Captain Lord? Yeah. This is all you can serve. Do you have any questions regarding that? So it is fourteen thirty nine hours on January twenty fifth. Scott, while she reads through the new warrant that she just, you know, had dropped onto her bikini, um, and you see Chad leaning over as though he needs to know too, um, what do you make of what you're seeing here? It's the things we don't see that should be concerning. We see no shock at all, no, no wondering what's going on. I think maybe she thought she was going to be arrested because you see her breath rate go way up. It skyrockets at the very beginning there, especially when she's sitting up. Her, you can see that her, her breath rate is really, really going, uh, going strong. He and his body language, he's fairly relaxed, this guy. She's a little bit stiff, but he's relaxed. And so that's, I think... That would give me the impression if I was talking to these people in an interrogation situation separately that, and looking at this, this guy uh, didn't do it, but he knows about it and all that. But he's not concerned about himself at all, not even a little bit or much for her. He's just sort of leaning over, look at look how smoothly he moves compared to her. She's fairly stiff and straight, but we're not seeing the things we should be seeing in there. No shock, no questions. Um, when, when you get information like this, like when you see uh, the... Uh, obituary when someone in your family dies and you see it it dawns on you again what's happened and when somebody says something the whole thing dawns on you the reality of the horror that's happened to this this family member and we're not seeing that on her either or him either one yeah. and it doesn't yeah. seem to bother him at all not even a little bit and by and this doesn't. point I, I i'd like to add by this date january 25th those children have been dead and buried in his backyard for now four months and that is the reaction scott rouse thank you so much for, the, for your expertise i really needed someone to get me off the ledge today and tell me if i was crazy for thinking the things i was thinking so i appreciate it thank you for watching go to newsnationnow.com to find news nation on your television provider and don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of news nation's fact-driven unbiased coverage